What is going on guys, it's Azure here, welcome back to another Wolves video. Today I'm going to be um, reviewing the first six fixtures uh, we have um, in this upcoming Premier League season. And we've got quite a good start to be honest, we've got um, a few winnable games. So starting off the season we have an away trip to Leicester, um, which is quite a good start to the season. Um, we we were quite unfortunate in the away trip to Leicester last season, the second game of the season. We were quite unlucky, uh, a 2-0 defeat away at Leicester last season. Um, and um, it, it just showed um, our, I would say, possibly inexperienced in the Premier League at that, that point last season, in the second game of the season, how we were, we were struggling to adapt to life back in the Premier League. The second game, we've got the small matter of a game against uh, against Man United, which we, we did well against Man United. We drew one all in um, in September uh, last season uh, at Old Trafford. That was quite a good draw. With Jan Martino scoring um, his only goal um, of, of the season last season uh, in that game, and. Also, um, you can forget in April as well, where we um, uh, we went behind in that game, uh, but we managed to turn it around uh, and beat Man United uh, 2-1. Obviously, we also beat them a couple of weeks earlier uh, in the FA Cup quarter-final as well. So yeah, we got we got quite a good uh, start to the season. Um, we've also got um, a home game against Burnley. Um, home game against Chelsea as well, which uh, we did quite well against Chelsea. Uh, we ended a, a bit of a barren run uh, towards the end of 2018 uh, with uh, a 2-1 win at the start of December, a home to Chelsea. And um, obviously, uh, we came so close um, in early March to um, pick up a win at Stamford Bridge, uh, but falling short um, in added time through a Eden Hazard goal, who's obviously now uh, gone off to Real Madrid. We've also got uh, so we've got quite a few winnable games, um, uh, but we've also got um, um, we've got some. They also can be tricky games as well, uh, including Crystal Palace, who we beat. Um, we beat away from home one 0 with a, a Matt Doherty goal in October, um, but also at the same time. Um, and in the first game of 2019, we lost 2-0 at home to him. We uh, struggled quite a bit in that game uh, to get a foothold. Um, and that, that was quite the co common theme of um, of last season. We we struggled quite uh, quite a lot uh, against the uh, the bottom half of the league, uh, but did quite well um, against uh, the big six teams um, and uh, took a lot of points off them. Um, so Crystal Palace is probably uh, a game uh, to look out for and a game that um, hopefully we can do better in um, hopefully we can do better in um, that than we did um, last season although uh, I think I do believe it is a, an away game to Crystal Palace so um, we, we, we did beat them 1-0 away from home last season uh, through Matt Doherty goal and hopefully we can repeat the feat uh, in this upcoming season. We've got quite a good start to the season, quite a good uh, first six fixtures of the season. Um, quite, um, obviously, um, we've also got the added inclusion of the Europa League. Uh, obviously, we've got um, we've got a Faroe Islands team, um, uh, which I can't. I can't quite remember off the top of my head. Or well, we've got uh, Northern Ireland, Northern Ireland team, uh, Crusaders uh, as well. We could play either of those teams in the second qualifying round. Those those ties obviously will be played um, before the season starts. So that's the adequate inclusion as well. And you've, depending on how far we get in the Europa League, uh, these these um, these fixtures could potentially be moved around. Um, obviously, the Leicester game has been moved uh, from the Saturday to the Sunday um, due to possible um, Europa League involvements. Overall, a decent start to the season, and um, yeah, 
hopefully we can pick up quite a few points and make a decent start to the 2019-20 season. Yeah, hopefully you did enjoy this uh, fixtures review. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. And um, now, obviously, the season is well and truly over. Uh, I will be, um, hopefully, to keep um, consistent uploads uh, throughout the summer. Hopefully, um, I can bring you uh, some Wolves transfer updates um, throughout the summer, and especially as we, um, we, we kick into July, the... Uh, uh, the bids will be uh, begin to be made. Um, yeah, I'll see you um, potentially in a few days um, with hopefully a Wolves transfer update. Until then, goodbye, guys.